Princess Anne is poised to take part in a rare joint outing with her brother, King Charles III. The royal siblings will travel to Buckingham Palace on Thursday to present the new sovereign standard to the Blues and Royals. In her role as Royal Colonel of the Blues and Royal, Princess Anne, 72, will attend the presentation which is due to take place in the quadrangle of Buckingham Palace. 35 service personnel and 27 military working horses will be on parade in the quadrangle for the presentation of the new standard, which usually takes place every decade. The Blues and Royals, Royal Horse Guards and First Dragoons, were last presented with their standard by the late Queen Elizabeth II back in May 2014. The monarch's arrival on Thursday will be announced by fanfare, after which the king will receive a royal salute from the Blues and Royals. Princess Anne shares an incredibly close bond with her older brother, Charles. Their sweet connection was clear to see at His Majesty's historic coronation, which took place on May 6. For the special occasion, Princess Anne served as King Charles's personal bodyguard, protecting her brother on his big day. The Princess Royal followed King Charles and Queen Consort Camilla's carriage on horseback as they left Westminster Abbey and returned to Buckingham Palace, leading a procession of armed forces personnel. In her role as Charles's gold stick in waiting, Princess Anne wore a majestic green silk velvet thistle cloak. It boasted a lining of white taffeta and featured a hand embroidered gold badge and garter blue velvet hood. But fans may not have realized she was wearing her blues and royals uniform underneath, adorned with her medals. She gave a rare interview to CBC News, saying, I have a role as the Colonel of the Blues and Royals in the Household Cavalry Regiment as Gold Stick. And Gold Stick was the original close protection officer. So that is a role I was asked if I'd like to do for this coronation, so I said yes. Not least of all, it solves my dress problem. Princess Anne and Charles's close bond dates back to their childhood. As youngsters, the late Queen's children frequently lent on each other for support when their parents went away on royal tours. The duo have since been by each other's side in times of need. Aside from the occasional joint outing, the sibling duo have witnessed a number of key life events. From Prince Charles's investiture as the Prince of Wales in 1969, to Princess Anne's participation in the 1976 Olympics in Montreal, Charles and Anne have marked huge personal milestones together. Meanwhile, in September 2022, Princess Anne was a true pillar of support as she walked by her brother's side during the late Queen's emotional coffin procession towards Windsor Castle.